Phoenix and in Utah with the Utah Jazz is where we remember him the most. Got a great basketball background. So the Knicks win the tip. Beasley then was traded out of Houston the next season. James with the alley -oop to Capella. I think he was trying to set up Capella, but they did a good job of boxing him out of there. Courtney Lee had a hot night last night and continues as he hits a three. Yeah, Hardaway's taking a big step up. They lost Carmelo Anthony, of course, as you know, as he went to Oklahoma City. And there's a basket by Beasley, and he draws the foul. He scored 12, 14 points in about eight minutes and was very efficient. The beautiful little spin move. Beasley can put it in the basket. He really can. He also, uh, when he scores. On two fast break, and they, and they go for the three-point shot. Beasley doesn't like that three. He likes that medium range shot right there, and that, that's a good shot for him. In fact, Beasley has not made a three this year. He's only attempted six. This guy can shoot it from anywhere. Courtney Lee is really a good player. He competes yeah. every single night. Had six threes in that game. Into O'Quinn, no defense. Well, the weak side was slow getting over. That's the same high pick and roll the Rockets run. That defender has to make a decision. Perfect from the field. He's number one in the NBA in accuracy. All the way, of course, Beasley now and Hardaway with a straight on jumper. Rockets defense very porous here to start this game. Not giving free throws to? Sure seems that way, man. Gotta play a little defense. Come on. Rockets are just in a sleepwalk to start this game, giving up another layup. Harden gets around Lee. Oh, good heavens. He was hammered on that. No whistle. Unbelievable. Courtney Lee at the three-point line, and the Rockets are just letting New York shoot. But what happens on the offensive end? you got to get back and play some defense. There's Courtney Lee wide open again. He's been in the league a long time. Always protects the basketball. Good shooter when he has to be. Look at that ball movement by New York. Beasley gets the layup. In the open court, he's got options. Gives it up. One more time to Courtney Lee. This time he misses. Ball is tipped right to Beasley. Guys are, that are hot. Or motivated. I'll just take defense. Beasley walks it right in for another layup. How many layups do you suppose New York has? Beasley on Anderson. Good shot by Michael Beasley. Ryan Anderson gives it up to James. James on the drive. Lays it up and in for two and one. Maybe that'll get the Rockets going. You see the Woodlands Church Super Bowl right here. Beasley reaches in. Harden makes him pay with an and one. Rockets off to a slow start, but remember the Rockets scored a season low 24 points in the first quarter in New York. Harden gets around. Jared Jack for two. Has a myriad of good moves. Misses that one. James in the open oh. court. Great pass. Oh. 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 Well, the league does because he's leading the league in assists. Chris Paul checks in for him, so you'll have Chris Paul and Eric Gordon in the backcourt. Mamute with a foul, and the basket counts. Look at him just spin out of there. Mamute overplaying, and McDermott with a real good in the first quarter. Luke Mamute. Ball back to Rhino from deep. Oh, man. And a timeout. Back inside. And Beasley again with the new season high. And the dunk press. Think I know who's supposed to guard him. Ryan Anderson looks... In good form. There will be about a six-second difference. Shot clock, game clock, both teams in the penalty. Aaron Gordon with a three. <laughs> Do is get back in a bigger hole here in the second. Beasley to the basket. 
Up and in. The drive. Nice pass to Capella. Ryan with that fall away. Got it. Shot clock was all the way down. That's just too easy. There's no weak side help and no recognition of keeping your guy in front of you. Ryan's open again. Great find by Ariza. That's his three-point usage right there. Easily to the bucket for two more. My goodness. Does he ever do anything but shoot layups? Both of these teams are good rebounding teams. Rockets, one of the best defenses. There's a pickpocket for you. Chris Paul doing what he does best. Eric Gordon to Capella to Ryan. Yeah, that's a way to move it. Defense by Houston. Eric Gordon gets a step, lays it up and in. Did not get the foul he wanted. Eric Gordon says, I can get this done. Good game. Good switch there between Capella and Ariza. Ryan Anderson to the basket. And he has it blocked out of bounds. In terms of offense. Yeah, but when you lose a player like Carmelo Anthony, you, you miss him. Well, you know, I, I know that. I'm with Chris Paul. Bahamute with the Moutre. Beasley up and in. No answer for Michael Beasley here in the first half. Just a great all-around guy. We're going to miss him. Yeah, we really are. And uh, there's a block by Capella. Chris Paul to the bucket and draws a foul. Late whistle. One-on-one -on -one in the post. With Hernan Gomez and Clint just says, get that out of here. That jump starts the fast break, and the Rockets, they... The Knicks only four for 13 in that time here in the second quarter with five turnovers. The Rockets have converted into nine points. Billy. Hard deep. And the Rockets have regained the lead. Rockets starters are one for nine. The bench is seven for 12 from behind the arc. That's the beauty of having a, a deep bench, because on nights like this, they can really bail you out. James to Capella. Bounced up in the air, and P.J. was right there to put it back. Guy, got to have a guy that will do all the dirty work. He loves doing it. Jerry Jack, back-to-back -back bucket for him. Minute 20 left to play. In the first half, James with the okie doke on Willie Hernan Gomez. Jared Jack got in a whole bunch of trouble. Hardaway, acrobatic shot hanging in the air. But if you had told the Knicks they'd be up almost one point in half, coming into this game without Porzingis and Cannon, they take it. Yeah, indeed. Hardaway with the basket. Out to compete. And that's the mark of a true perfect professional. He joined us late. Porzingis and Cantor are out of the game. Great pass to Ariza from the beard. Rockets had two starters out in the last game, so Ariza picked it up. O'Quinn, he doesn't get too many of those jumpers. If you, if you go to him, he can score. He's four. He has four points. James Harden from Pasadena. Pass inside to O'Quinn and Capella returns to Cinder. Back to PJ all the way across court to Ariza for a Ariza. Beasley trying to get open. Tucker has shut him down. Two on one fast break. Ariza to the bucket. PJ Tucker started it off with defense. Ariza looking for his shot a little more. And he puts up another one and he got it. Trevor Ariza. Beasley didn't want to take a three. And going inside, that's Capella land. And O'Quinn was able to get it back up and in. Helping each other, really putting in the effort on the defensive end. Yeah, somebody put the plug in. The energy's up. James with three. Harden now with. 21 points. That's contagious. Yes, it is. Jared Jack puts it up. 
Beasley. That short jumper, and he continues to score. He's struggling tonight from the field. James into Capella. Nice pass to Ariza. Got it again. Trevor Ariza. Four minutes. James. Putting on a show. Capella finishes it off. Show in Broadway. <laughs> it's a good one. Yeah. Down and low again, and Beasley puts it up and in. It was an intimidation by Clint. There's another steal as James to the bucket for two more. It's amazingly how quick the Rockets have blown this game open here in the third quarter. Boy, that was a nifty move. Beat the basket. the third quarter all the way outside that trapping defense and finally a three-point shot by Lance Thomas free throw line won't go Rocky still has six seconds Chris Paul can do a bunch of things Rhino says I can do one thing really well Ryan Anderson Eric Gordon back to cool hand Luke. Last couple weeks, Luke has really been stroking. He's three for four behind the arc. Rockets are now 15 of 34 behind the three-point line. And the Knicks hit a jumper. Which is a good thing. That's what you want going down the stretch. What a pass. Chris Paul, he's a magician. All right, now it's time for the Chris Paul clinic. Chris Paul. Exactly. Oh, Quinn. Got trapped inside. Rhino with a block. But he can only go up once. O'Quinn with the basket. Another pass to Nene. Between the legs. And uh, that cost him. Got to get back on defense. Five on four advantage. That gives him a wide open look for a three. Really flourished at Houston, though. He, he was a good player last year. Blocked by Nene. He says, don't bring that weak stuff in here, Bees. Quinn got it inside. Put up a nice little jump hook. Bees has been in that lane for about, let's see, eight seconds now. Nice backdoor play to Jared Jack, and you know the head coach is not happy. I think it's kind of late in his career, and that's a lot of, you know, his, his handicap kind of hurt him. He wasn't very mobile. You know, going back to that Knicks situation, too, that uh, there's Beasley with the basket. Yeah, yes. in New York. Well, New York is a very tough sports town. Of course, Isaiah was there before. There's a three by James Harden in the game and then went on an 83 to 42 run. Two and one. Tyreek Black just checked into the game a moment ago and he com commits the foul. Thank you, Bill. She was Zodico and all day today had a big party for him. 82 and Dorstown. Isn't that great? Unbelievable. Shot from the outside is good by Jared Jack Lee. 14 for O'Quinn. 30 points for Michael Beasley. But he had them all early. Great pass. 37 points for Harden. And eight assists for him. O'Quinn walked all over the place, got the basket, and the foul on Tyron Black against the Warriors. They got a lot of talent, and if they can get it together, Bill, the Thunder could be trouble. It's another double-double for Clint Capella. He has 12 points and 14 rebounds. <laughs> Another threes up. This is Capella clears it out, puts it up with the left hand, won't go. And 
before he can get it off, the buzzer goes off.